Oh, how cool is this? I finally found a place that has the wraith set up. I told you to stay away. Okay guys, today I am in Reading, Pennsylvania. Maybe it's pronounced Reading, Pennsylvania, even though it's pronounced Reading, California and Reading Railroad, I don't know. But there is a Spirit Halloween right in front of me. Now I could be wrong, I'm sure someone will correct me, but I believe this used to be an AC Moore. Look how huge the Spirit sign is on this one. That sign is absolutely enormous. One of the biggest I have seen on a Spirit Halloween. All right, let's go in and check this out. Hopefully they have all the animatronics that we've been waiting for. And holy crap, I forgot my hat, but that's okay. Because we're not here to see the hat. We're here to see Spirit Halloween and the awesomeness. Guys, I'm so disappointed because I don't see the animatronics I was wanting to see, but I do see some other things that I haven't seen before in other stores. So this is gonna be cool no matter what. Okay, we do have Mr. Howell here. However, we're not gonna start with him today. We always start with him. You guys are probably tired of seeing the same thing over and over and over. So we're gonna go over here to something else I see. No, not Punctured Pete, but it is one that I said I wanted to see set up. Look at this guy right here, Headless Jack. Isn't that what his name is? Yeah, Headless Jack, holy crap. I don't know why they call him Headless Jack because he definitely does have a head. I know, Bubba, I'll get to you in just a minute. So yes, Headless Jack, I don't know what he does. Look at the size of these arms. They're so long, what the heck? Okay, I hope, I know I'm coming. Okay, I hope this is his. Let's see if it'll go. Well, apparently it's not gonna do anything, but there are signs on everything that say do not touch the animatronics. So I don't know if people like, maybe they broke them. I don't know. Maybe there's just been so many people in here stomping on those that they broke them. All right, Bubba, do what you're gonna do. There you go. Hello, Mr. Bubby. Hello, Bubby. I like you. Oh crap, I touched an animatronic. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, I'm out. Don't get me in trouble. Nightcrawler, let's see what you can do. He's not working either. What in the heck did people do to these animatronics? All right, look, we got the pumpkin carvomatic, and what I notice in here different from other places is they got some serious chainsaw sounds going on, guys. This is absolutely crazy and so loud. And look at this, we have a brown jumping spider, and he actually works. Hello, Mr. Brownie. Okay, we're gonna go through the chains of death here. This is so loud in here right now. Please do not pull on the chains of death. What the heck is going on in Reading, Pennsylvania, guys? People must be wreaking havoc on the Spirit Halloween in Reading, Pennsylvania. Okay, let's come on back over here for a minute and we'll get Mr. Howell going. Here he goes. Okay, give it to me. There you go, okay. And I did notice that we have the Hauntress hiding back here. There's a second foot pedal, so let's hit it and see if that belongs to her. I don't know. Will she jump? Will she jump? No, I guess not. You keep hiding there, my friend. All right, let's go back through the chains of death. Don't worry, we're not pulling the chains, I promise. Oh, how cool is this? I finally found a place that has the wraith set up. Let's see if we can get him going. There we go, yes, listen. So cool. Back and forth, up and down. I love it. <laughs> so spooky. That is so cool. That makes me so glad that I came to this location today, guys. So awesome, I love the sounds. Sounds like a haunted mansion. Okay, before we move on to the rest, I wanna show you this. This is what I could see from the door that I said I had not seen in other stores before. This is from Beetlejuice, and look at this. This is so cool. I can't believe they only have the one, though, instead of him and his wife. But look at his face, and there's where his hand came through the back, if you remember in the movie. 
And then look at his hands with the eyeballs on his fingers. That is hilarious. Adam is his name. I can never remember. But yeah, remember he put his hand up here and he pushed out his nose and then he put his other hand through the back of his head there. That is so cool. We've got lots of animatronics in here for sale, guys. I'm gonna get to those in just a minute, but let's go over and see what they got set up over here. Okay, it is pretty much the same as what they have in the other stores. You know, sometimes they swap them out when they don't have these to set up. So it's always fun to come in and look and see what they do have set up. So we're gonna start with this jolly guy right here. <laughs> he is so dang loud, man. <laughs> All right, let's move on over here and give these guys their due. Jumping black and white spider. Okay, let's get the Harvester of Souls going. Come on. Nope, he's not going to work, I guess. All right, see if we can get Wacky Mole going. Come on, Wacky. Come on, what in the heck is going on in here? Half of these, like, are not even plugged in, or... I don't know. I don't know what's happening in this area, but... Please do not touch the animatronics, because apparently everyone has broken them. Let's go over and look here a second on the other side. No, they don't have anything set up over here, any animatronics, I mean. So let's go ahead and look at what they have on the floor, because they have a whole bunch of animatronics set up, stacked up around this whole place. To start with, as always, we have a giant stack of jumping spiders. Guys, we got the black ones. Uh, there's the black and red. I'm sure we have brown ones in here somewhere. Um, or I could be wrong. I don't see any brown ones. All right, well, that's cool anyway. Over here, look at this. Look how many sitting scarecrows they have. Oh my gosh, there's like 12 of them here. Holy crap. What in the world is up with the overflow of sitting scarecrows this year? We got a Sam here, if anybody's looking for him. And right on the other side of him, we have two wraiths. That is so cool. I'm gonna have to go over and watch him one more time before I leave. Over here, we got a Night Stalker waiting for someone to add him to their collection. Oh, we have two of Man's Possessed Friends, two Bubbas. We got two Punctured Peets here. Look at this, how cool. They have more animatronics for sale than any other store I've seen so far this year. We got two Waving Wallies over here. Okay, oh, and here's a whole other stack of Jumping Spiders, and yes, we do have the brown ones in this stack. So no matter what color you're looking for, they got it. And look what we have right here, guys. They have two headless jacks in stock on the floor. So very cool. Would have been much better if we could have seen him actually working up there, because I don't know what he actually does. Let's just look at it a minute. So he has a light up pumpkin head with haunting phrases, lurking posable arms, and that's apparently it. Maybe he doesn't move, maybe he just lights up and talks. Oh, and we do have another stack of them over here too, so they have plenty of jumping spiders, guys. Look, we have a Sam candy bowl that I don't think I've seen in other stores. What the? Is that a candy bowl or is it? It's a planter. You plant a plant in his head. We have the light up Sam's, pretty cool. And then we have the Sam Greeters that has the popcorn bowl or you can put trick or treat candy in or whatever. Ooh-wee, look at this one. Halloween Curse of Michael Myers fleece throw. I don't care that much for the Curse of Michael Myers as far as the movie goes, but that is an awesome picture right there. Oh, I always forget Sam over here. He's off to the side, so I always forget him out of it. And look, he has the alternate head. How cool. Hello, alternate head Sam. Let's see if he works. Here we go, he works, kind of. He's talking, he has the alternate head, but he's not moving his arm with his killer sucker. Okay, man, they are seriously overloaded with signs of what you can and can't do in here. Do not touch the animatronics. Do not try on the masks. And I can understand that, guys, you know. COVID. They have some Chucky stuff here, just the regular costumes and things like that. They have the Chucky socks that I bought the other day. Look at this. They have Chucky iron-on patches and lapel pins. Those are cool. Look at the little knife. That is so awesome. But I noticed that they have the Chucky mask on the other side of the store, so we'll go see that in just a minute. They have awesome Halloween stuff here. They have the jumpsuits. They have the Halloween hats. They have the socks. I did buy some Michael Myers socks the other day, but I don't think these are the ones. 
Look at this, they have the pins here too. And look at the awesome little knife with Michael Myers' face on it. That is so cool. We have this knife here, but this is more of like a scream knife. Here's the Halloween mask from 2018. Halloween 2 here, the Boogeyman shirt. They have both of the Beetlejuice masks here, the full head and just the face. Beetlejuice socks and teeth. Somebody wanted to see Joker stuff the other day they were talking about, so here's a Joker jacket. Look, they have a whole Joker suit. That's pretty sweet. Even the tie that says ha 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 ha. Joker cosmetic kit. We got a ha 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 bow tie. We got the ha 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 suspenders. And look at this, this is totally awesome. It's not the Joker, but it is the Riddler. A complete Riddler suit. How cool is that? Holy crap, they have the purple Tinky Winky suit. Remember I was talking about this the other day? They got Tinky Winky, they got Lala, they got Dipsy. Aw oh, man, they don't have Poe. They're always missing one, what the heck? Oh my gosh, but they do have both the SpongeBob and the Patrick Inflatables and Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. That's so cool. This store is actually stocked up pretty good, guys. Six foot inflatable skeleton hands. They got the toe tappers, let's see if they work. Yes. Those are hilarious. They have the scarecrow door knockers. Um, okay, here we go. Well, this one talks, but this one looks better. Monster crawling hands, creepy clowns, vintage clowns, and creepy skull pathway markers. Ginormous fuzzy spiders. Okay, let's go over and look at these masks, because here's the Chucky masks I was telling you about. Here's one from Child's Play 2. That is pretty creepy. Oh my gosh, look at this one. His face is smashed in, so it looks like he's going, ooh. <laughs> this is a pretty sweet Don Post mask up here, like a spooky ghost. That looks like the kind of ghost you'd see on a Scooby-Doo episode. What in the world? Here's some marshmallow stuff, but they have different masks. Like, here's the regular one, and then here's a new style. Looks like a skull. And what in the world is this one? I've never seen this one before. We got the marshmallow microphone, reversible plush throw blanket. This is on one side and that's on the other. And then we have the marshmallow jumpsuit. Oh look, we even have a marshmallow trick-or-treat bag. Holy crap, here's a kid's Chucky jumpsuit. That kid looks very close to Chucky. And they even have a girl Chucky suit. That is so cool. Oh, here's a cool Beetlejuice mug I don't think I've seen before. It's got the Here Lies Beetlejuice headstone on it. That's pretty sweet. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. Lots of different prop skulls. All right, guys, we're gonna leave the stickers right here in the witch's cauldron this time. I'm so happy about all the animatronics they actually have on the floor for sale in here. But before we go, I wanna come over here one more time and see the Wraith in action. This is one of my favorites just because it's so classic and cool. I love it so much. It's so simple, but it's so awesome. All right. Oh my gosh, guys, I almost missed this right here. I have never seen this in a store before. Welcome, have a knife day, and it's Michael Myers. How cool is that? Oh my gosh, look, they have the Corpse Bride costumes. I don't think I've ever seen this in one of the stores either. They have Corpse Bride tattoos, Corpse Bride socks, that is an awesome costume right there. Look at this, guys. They also have two of these, the Chrome Edition Ghost Face. This Chrome Edition was put out for like the 25th anniversary of Scream. I actually bought one of these at one of the other stores, but it was a kid's size suit. This is adults right here. Both of them are. Okay, guys, that is it for that location. I bought another Scream outfit just because it is so cool. One more look here at the Spirit in Reading, Pennsylvania. I told you to stay away! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god.